hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video we will be discussing about Planck's equation and the numerical based on this equation which are most important in gate point of view so let us start Planck's equation is generally used for calculation of freezing time and the formula given as Tf equals to Lf into rho f divided by Tf minus Ta multiply by P A upon H plus R A square divided by K. Tf is time of freezing, rho F is density of food, Lf is latent heat of food, Tf is freezing temperature or freezing point of food and Ta is a temperature of a cooling medium. What happened during freezing? The heat is conducted from the interior of the food to the surface of the food and is removed by the freezing medium. And the freezing medium is basically a cold air. So Ta is the temperature of that freezing medium. Now A is the thickness for slab and diameter for cylinder and spare. H is convective heat transfer coefficient and K is thermal conductivity. The value of P and R depend on geometry of the body. Like for slab, P is 1 by 2 and R is 1 by 8. For cylinder, P is 1 by 4, R is 1 by 16. And for spare, P is 1 by 6 and R is 1 by 24. How to remember this? Like uh, for slab, P is 1 by 2. Multiply the denominator for by 4, you can get 1 by 8. Same in case of cylinder, 1 by 4. Multiply by 4, you will get 16. So 1 by 16 is our value for cylinder. And for spare, P is 1 by 6. Multiply by 4, you will get the value of R for spare, that is 1 by 24. So based on the equation of Planck, let, let us discuss some numerical. The first is, how long would it take to freeze an apple of 10 cm diameter if cold air at minus 30 degree centigrade blows across it to he give heat transfer coefficient of 100 watt per meter square Kelvin. It is asking for the freezing time and the thermal conductivity of frozen apple is 1.10 watt per meter Kelvin. The density of apple is 760 kg per meter cube. The moisture content is 88% and a freezing temperature of apple is given minus 0.9 degree centigrade. And the latent heat of fusion is 333.2 kilojoule per kg. Latent heat of fusion is 333.2 kilojoule per kg. So now let us see the solution. The latent heat of freezing for water in apple. 88% uh, is the moisture content given in the question. So the latent heat of freezing for water in apple we can calculate by multiplying the moisture content present in apple that is 0 0.88 into the latent heat of fusion that is 333.2 kilojoule per kg. So we get 293.2 kilojoule per kg. We know that in question Tf is given as minus 0 0.9 degree centigrade Ta that is the temperature of cooling medium is given as minus 30 degree centigrade. The diameter of an apple is given as 10 centimeter that is 0 0.1 meter. Convective heat transfer coefficient is given 100 watt per meter square Kelvin and K is given 1.10 watt per meter Kelvin. Density is also given 760 kg per meter cube. As we already know that the apple is in spare shape. So the P is 1 by 6 and R is 1 by 24. This is the formula of to calculate the freezing time according to Planck's equation. Tf is equals to rho f into Lf. Tf minus Ta Pa upon H plus R A square upon K. So now let us put the value. Rho F is given 760. Lf we calculate 293.2. It is given in kilojoule. So we convert it into joule by multiplying by 1000. Tf is given minus 0 0.9 and the Ta is given minus 30. 1 by 6 is the value of P. A is 0 0.1 and H is 100. 1 by 24 is the value of R, A is 0 0.1, 1.10 is the value of K. After solving this equation, we get 4177.02 second. We have to convert the second into R. So the actual answer is 1.16 hour. So the total time taken for freezing an apple is 1.16 hour. This is the right answer. Now the second question is 
freezing of 100 mm spherical meat ball with 60% moisture at 35 degrees centigrade is being done in an air blast freezer maintained at minus 45 degrees centigrade. This is the temperature of the cooling medium. Given latent heat of fusion for water is 333.2 kJ per kg. Thermal conductivity of meat is 1.5 watt per meter degree centigrade. This is the value of K and convective heat transfer coefficient is the value of H which is 40 watt per meter square degree centigrade. Density of frozen meat is 980 kg per meter cube and initial freezing temperature of meat ball is minus 10 degree centigrade. Using Planck's equation, freezing time is. This is the question uh, once asked in gate examination. Let us discuss the solution. A, which is the uh, uh, diameter, is given as 100 millimeter spherical meat ball. So the 0 0.1 meter by converting millimeter into meter. Rho F is a density. This is 980 kg per meter cube. T A is given minus 45. T F is given minus 10 degree centigrade. H is 40 and K is 1.5. Now LF is calculated as 0.6. 60% moisture is given and 333.2. This is the latent heat of fusion of water. So the latent heat of food is calculated as 199.92 kg per kilojoule per kg. Now after putting the value in Planck's equation, we get this answer 3887.33 joule per watt. As we all know, 1 watt is 1 joule per second. So the answer is 3887.33 second. After converting the second into R, we get 1.079 R or 1.08 hour. This is the correct answer for this question. Thank you. If you like my video, please do subscribe, share and like to my channel.